A vacation for a Kansas City family turned into a nightmare when they became stranded at the Dallas Fort Worth Airport. Now the airline promised to make it right, and when that didn't happen, call for action got involved. Keith King picks it up from there. Yeah, guys, good evening. The Hummeringhausen family tried to fly to Florida with a stop in Dallas, but storms came through, trapping them in the Big D. What happened next was a big problem when they tried to get a refund, so they called for action. Dave Homrickhausen enjoys some father-son time each morning with his two kids, four-year-old Kaysen and one-year-old Wolfgang. Last year, a family trip to Florida to visit Grandma and Grandpa turned into a nightmare. We had little kids, sick kids. You know, we you know we didn't have any place to stay. Yeah, you know, all the rental cars were gone. I mean, we were just really stuck. Their American Airlines flight to Florida became stalled in Dallas due to bad weather. The family was stuck. Here's a picture of their overnight accommodations at the airport. Not pleasant. Maybe a couple days to, before we got a flight to Florida. Um, and they said it could be the end of the week before they found something back to Kansas City. Dave's dad drove from Kansas City to pick them up. American promised a full refund due to what's called a flight in vain. Back in Kansas City, the refund never came. Dave tried to use his work skills to connect with the right person at American, but could not. Calling businesses, finding people, finding phone numbers is something I do every day. And I could not find somebody to talk to. Frustrated, he called for action. We contacted American's media representative. They blamed the refund delay on Americans filing for bankruptcy. American finally refunded Dave $1,041, the price of three tickets. The spokesman apologized for all the inconvenience. Collect names, collect contact information, really, really stay on top of it, and uh, maybe get a hold of you guys if uh, that's not working. Now, airlines have a, a limited refund policy for reasons such as weather, but since this family was unable to get a flight out to Florida or even back here to Kansas City, American coded it as a flight in vain, allowing them a full refund. Call for Action is currently looking for some dedicated volunteers to help solve consumer problems like the one you just saw. For more information, you can email me, king at NBCActionNews.com. For Call for Action, I'm Keith King.